Hey folks, Seducium here, continuing to play through the Curse of Nexramus. I am playing uh, normal difficulty right now, we're just going through unlocking this stuff, and we are going to play against Hagen, the Unclean. So, I don't know what deck I'm going to roll with yet. Uh, maybe we'll try... Let's try Stabby Lady. It's been a while. But this is kind of a, not really a miracle rogue, but my attempt at a miracle rogue, minus Leroy Jenkins and stuff. But it's just a, a rogue deck, basically. Um, we'll roll with this. So he can deal two damage to anything on the left, which means if I only have one creature out, he's going to be dealing two damage to it. So, like Loot Hoarder, there's no point of playing that. This, unfortunately, I'm going to have to take some damage, but I don't have a good way of killing it otherwise, so we'll uh, oh, backstab, Here we go. remove, and it's going to deal some damage to my opponent, so we each take a little bit of damage. Flame Imp, good. Deal damage to him as well. So far, <laughs> everything's coming up Millhouse. Um, Here we go. We're going to do this, refresh our daggers, and should I deadly poison them? I'm going to assume he doesn't have a way of getting rid of my deadly poison, and so I will. Hopefully he doesn't have an acidic swamp poos or something equally as annoying. Okay, it's an interesting uh, card. It's actually a pretty good card as far as demons go. Um, so, what am I doing? What am I thinking? I'm going to put the Gnomish Inventor out first. Gets me a head crack that I can play Here later on. I hate to do it. hate to take the damage. I can't kill that, so we'll kill the imp. And we'll try it this way. The Gnomish Inventor at least doesn't die to this. That stinks. For obvious reasons. Now he's going to start dealing two damage. Um, so I could Sinister Strike and then Eviscerate for four and then trade, which is not a terrible idea. It's not a great idea. Alternatively, no, I don't have a good alternative. Hey, give me a minute. Oh, are you serious? That's the random demon you get. Here we go. Tisk tisk. I'm not gonna put any of these guys out because they'll just die. Oh, two doom guards. <laughs> yeah. Nope. This didn't work out. Didn't work out at all. I mean, I... Putting these guys out there. They're just gonna die too. The Doom Guard. I'm I'm still playing because I want to see what kind of cards he has, but nope. All right. So I don't think this deck's gonna work for me. In fact, uh, neither is my Zoo deck because it's just too much, too much crap. Uh, small crap. Um, my Priest deck might work well. So let's give that a shot. Hagen the Unclean, not Hegon. You Egon, Egon the Unclean. So things like Mogashaw Warden would be great. Uh, Chilbo and Yeti is pretty good too. Plus my hero power can counteract his hero power. Not the best counter because I have to pay one more mana than him, but still, it's a counter. I was hoping he would do that because then I'm just going to kill it and he gets to take three damage. It's fine. I'm fine with the Void Walker. I'd rather kill your Death Charger. Oop. And I'm gone. That sucks. And I have a Holy Nova in here, but too little, too late kind of scenario. 
Uh, mind control would be great later on. Let's thought steal then. Bane of Doom was good. I will enjoy kind of. But I don't like where this is going. Shadow Word Pain. Um, well, Shadow Word Pain on you. And heal up. All right. So now Bane of Doom's useless. I was going to use Bane of Doom on that next turn. No such luck. Um, I could spell break one of these guys, but out of Voidwalker. Not a terrible idea. He'll use his uh, hero power to make this a 4 1 and then probably kill it with this. Again, not the best, but not a terrible play. Alternatively, I could put out a Chill Win Yeti, Voidwalker. Chill Win Yeti could absorb the damage. You know what? No, this is fine, because what I'll do is play this, and then put this on this side, on the left-hand side. So, what he'll have to do is trade that for that, or use his hero ability. Well, he didn't. Okay, it's fine. And then he does that. And that is the worst freaking thing. Um, I'm going to I'm going to start trying to keep myself alive for a little bit here. Another void walker. Hopefully this doesn't get buffed up. Oh, another void collar. Jesus, how many void collars is this? a lot is what that is. Uh, Doomsayer could be very useful here. Let's do... You know what? Screw it. You you made me do this. Do I want to? No, I'm just gonna hit him for one. Heal myself. Shouldn't be able to kill the Doomsayer. Maybe you can. Nope, he's not gonna kill the Doomsayer. Good. Or is he? Yes, he is, apparently. Well, that sucks. <laughs> I didn't think he, he would be able to. Alright, so... I really need that... Holy Nova. That's not it. it helps. Don't get me wrong. <clears throat> Alright, well, that'll kill his own things, that's okay. And then I can use this to help me out here for a bit. Uh, so I'm not going to play Ysera, instead I'm going to take this out. I'll take this out, the trade. I'll throw this guy out there. And I'll hopefully keep myself alive long enough to mind control the Doom Guard. Trade? No. Swamp Poos, okay. Ooh, this is tough because if I mind control the Doom Guard, I won't have enough. Let's does the faceless manipulator get me charge? Yes it does. It's not enough to kill the Doom Guard though. Crap. I mean, unless I run both of them into it. It's enough to clear this out, but then I still have a Doom Guard to contend with. I lost. Doesn't really matter. But let's see if the AI is stupid enough to not go for the kill. Nope. Alright, so... I really needed that Holy Nova. <laughs> Let's try our Holy Moses deck again. Um, and let's see if I can't just get better card draw. The other thing is I could always play as Shaman. Uh, he's going to take out my totems, but I can flood the board with minions, basically. 
shall bring victory. Uh, I can't justify keep, keeping a Sarah yet, so we'll keep Shadow Word Pain, of course. Mind Control doesn't do me any good this early on either. <coughs> Excuse me. I try not to cough into the mic, but sometimes it can't be helped. Northshire Cleric, no, if he gets charged. Well, actually, yeah, that's fine. Pretty much. That's what I was hoping for. Kind of trick him into uh, into doing that. Thank you. You're just helping me get cards. Right away. So the AI is just kind of doing damage. It's not. He's not really thinking about what he's damaging. Uh, this is good. Gets me an extra mana crystal. And I have plenty of Shadow Word Pains. Well, not plenty. I have two. Two Shadow Word Pains. So, we will heal that. And seeing how I kind of want to keep it alive. So, I'm thinking I... Oh, I hate to do it, but I'm thinking I shadow word paint on that. Just to keep this alive and well, and hopefully I can keep cycling cards this way. <laughs> like that. Uh, I really wish I could kill that. I need a Holy Nova. I know I have one in the deck. Is this it? That is not my Holy Nova. We'll throw the Loot Hoarder out there. And hit him for one. And you know, I could buff up one of these guys. But I'd rather save the buff for something like my taunt. It's annoying. Especially since it's going to just keep getting buffed up. I could face this manipulator on it. It's not a terrible idea. It's not the best idea I've ever had, but it's not a terrible idea either. Alternatively, I could just leave it be... We can play our Senjin Shield Master. I can Power Word Shield to keep it alive a little bit longer. I can Power Word Shield again if I really wanted to. Kinda do. Did he have any direct removal? I don't think so. Right away. Hey, give me that. I should keep it alive for a while. Didn't kill it, <laughs> so I don't know what he where he was going with that. Um, heal. Give me another card. Uh, the Shadow Priest. I don't think I can seal a minion that is um, stealthed. That's fine. We're gonna throw the Mogusham Warden out there, and then do a little bit of damage. How many cards do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I'm fine. Ah. Uh, that's what you're gonna faceless manipulate? You can't even heal. But okay. Alright, I'm starting to get too many cards here, so we'll throw that out there. We'll throw our other loot hoarder out there and just do a little bit of damage. So it's small iterations, small bits of damage, but it works. Adds up. I mean, that's good. 7-7 seven, seven is good. And he finally kills that. <laughs> it's okay. Because I have more than enough to win. So... Deal to damage to you. Double your health. And now we won. Yeah, alright. I should have taken a shower. See, that's what I mean. If people call you unclean, uh, that is a bad sign for you. I am seething. I am seething with anger. Seething. He is seething with anger. Apparently. So I've been told. Just being nearby, Lothar. Causes your flesh to rot. 
So I recommend a melee class. Thanks. I'll take your advice under advisement. Lotheb is a hideous reminder of the plague's effects on the creatures of Atheroth. Good. Wow. Okay, so we're on a timer. Necrotic R. Deal 3 damage to the enemy hero. Wow. Alright. Let's give this a shot if uh, this doesn't turn out well. I'll have to think about what deck I want to play. I need a quick deck. A lot of these are not quick. Let's try Warrior. My Warrior could be quick. Maybe if I can get a crazy combination of uh, Frothing Berserker out there. Lotheb! Uh, so Battle Rage, Battle Rage. I'll keep the Slam. No, maybe I'll keep one of the Battle Rages. And hope to get other cards. Execute and Fiery War Axe. Not exactly what I was going for. Holy shit! 75 life. That is crazy. And this isn't even heroic. This is just regular old Lotha. But at least, I mean, it's two mana, but still. That's uh, quite a counter there. Um, I hate to fiery war axe. You know what? Sorry, I'm up. I'm not gonna whirlwind for take care of one gnome. Now I might whirlwind. I hate to use the whirlwind uh, like this, but nope. Saving the whirlwind. We'll use the cruel taskmaster to kill one, and then hopefully it'll trade for the other. So my hero ability will be able to counteract this to a small degree. Unfortunately that just got buffed up. So we're gonna do this. Hero ability up. I mean shield block. I, I have cards to get me back some health, but still. Five spectral might. Which is annoying. I mean, that's what the Gore Howl's for. But still. If I put this out there, he might just straight up murder it. But I'm willing to take that chance. Let me shield block. Acolyte of Pain. Okay. To a minion, summon a spore. What the hell's a spore do? Give all enemy minions plus 8 attack. All enemy minions. That's this guy. <laughs> um, I put this out there. And I whirlwind. This guy's gonna get plus eight attack. Uh, not to mention, I got a card. And then, um,. Yes, because he's going to trade. So I don't have a good way of killing him. Let's just get two more cards. Unless he hits me directly, but I doubt. Okay, or he will just get me more cards that way. Ah, poo. At least he got rid of the Fiery War Axe and not my Gore Hell, which is going to be coming out next. Or soon. How do I want to handle this? Yeah, I think I have to gore hell. And start taking some of this stuff out. Another whirlwind would be really great. Oh jeez. That stinks. Yeah, so I definitely need to start putting stuff out there that'll stay alive. Um or get me cards and stuff. That's not going to help me. We'll throw you out there. We'll throw you out there. Um, I have to do this. This will get me armor plus enrage that guy. And actually turns all of my creatures into monsters. So that's really good. A zoo deck might be worthwhile here. He actually ignored that, although I'm starting to take a lot of damage, so um, 
does it's not helping me. Let's see what card I get. I'm gonna have to try to keep some of this stuff alive, right? Rampage on you. Hopefully you can stay alive. Frothing Berserker, sure. Sure. And now I can hit him for 12. So those spores are great. Uh, they really help. I just need to stay alive long enough. Spore burst. Summon a spore. I mean, that helps me. Thanks. You're just buffing up my own creatures. Thanks. <laughs> That really helps, actually. So I will trade for that and then try to take out these spores. Um, it's in my best interest, I think, to trade the Cochrane Elite, frankly. Maybe not. I'll keep the cock no lead around, but it is in my best interest to put as much crap out on the board as possible. So we'll put you out there. Now, you know what? Let's get a card, too. And then we will trade you. I don't want to take any more damage. In fact, I should have gotten armor. That would have been the smarter thing to do. Cochrane Elite would have been good, too. Uh, to get more charge, but oh well. Alright. He's down to five. <laughs> we can do this. Those spores. No! Well, that's fine. I still have Treants. It's fine. I can work with this. I thought he was going to wipe my board entirely. Uh, Alright. This is going to be insane on Heroic. I, I can tell. So, that was fun. That uh, Those spores saved me. Otherwise, this would have would not have worked. Uh, but we did it. No. <laughs> we did it. We won. And uh, now there's nothing stopping us except for the military quarter. Enemy spells cost five more next turn. That's a really good card. Plus, we've unlocked the class challenges. So that's really good. So... Yeah, stuff to look forward to. Anyways, with that, I am going to put a break in this video. Folks, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, my name's Adusium. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you guys tuning in. And I hope to catch you guys next time. Later.